Now. All right now, Kenya and India have today come together to hold bilateral talks on how to enhance agriculture in the industry to promote economic growth. Now, this follows President William Ruto's state visit to India in December 2023, where Kenya received $250 million line of credit to modernize agriculture. We are looking at uh, how best we can um, utilize our arable land uh, so that we can use it to produce um, the necessary food for this country. As you are aware, uh, Kenya is 80% arid and semi-arid, and um, those land are very fertile. If we can only open up in terms of irrigation, in terms of mechanization, but we've been having a challenge on getting support, financial support, and also other resources to open up on those business plans. The, uh, going by the, uh, the, 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 the discussions, and interactions and the large turnout today, I'm very confident that our, in, our businesses are very enthusiastic. In particular, Kenya has a very special role in the sense that it's a very fertile country, it's a very large landmass, very hardworking people, and uh, increasingly we are seeing that entrepreneurial culture is growing in this country. And government is facilitating, and it's very clear from the talks and my meetings with the permanent secretary here that government is very keen to facilitate uh, for Indian businesses to grow food products. And it's a more of a sharing of uh, each knowledge that we have uh, uh, with Kenya and growing food products together for both uh, uh, our markets and local markets and for humanity. All right, and now let's get to our...